Today's video topic is Visa Privia. Visa Privia is a rare but serious condition that can occur during pregnancy. It happens when the fetal blood vessels connecting the umbilical cord to the placenta run across or very near to the opening of the birth canal known as the cervix. Visa Privia is a relatively rare condition occurring in just one of 2,500 births. However, it is considered a serious condition because of the potential for complications, as it can cause the vessels to rupture and bleed, which can be life-threatening for both the mother and the baby. In fact, about 56% of untreated Vesa Previa cases result in the death of the baby. Causes Vesa Previa is a relatively rare condition, occurring in about 1 in 2,500 births. However, it is more common in certain groups of women, such as those who are pregnant with twins or multiple babies, or those women who have a low-lying placenta or a bilobed placenta, which is a placenta with two equally sized lobes. So when the umbilical cord connects between the two lobes, it could lie unprotected or very close to the cervix, and this can cause bleeding and bursting once the labor starts. Symptoms Sometimes vasa privia doesn't cause any symptoms and may go undetected for a long time, but it can cause bleeding from the vagina without pain. This can occur any time from the second trimester onwards, and the blood may be darker than normal, indicating that it is the baby's blood. Also, sometimes the fetus can have abnormal heart rate. It is very important to talk to your doctor immediately if you experience any bleeding during pregnancy. Diagnosis Vesa Privia is typically diagnosed using ultrasound. This is a painless and non-invasive test that the doctor can do to detect the presence of fetal blood vessels crossing the birth canal. Sometimes a color Doppler is used to add colors to the ultrasound image as it can be difficult to see the direction of blood flowing. Treatment If Vesa Privia is diagnosed early, it greatly increases the chances of the baby's survival, so it is very important to monitor the condition closely. In some cases, the fetal vessels may move away from the birth canal as the pregnancy progresses, so the condition resolves by itself, and you may be able to deliver the baby normally through the vagina. However, in some cases, the doctor will recommend delivering the baby early, typically by C-section, as this is the safest way to ensure that the baby doesn't lose too much blood. You may be given steroids to accelerate the development of the baby's lungs before the delivery. Also, your doctor may recommend you to stay in the hospital for some days before the early labor. After the delivery, the baby may require treatment in the intensive care unit to recover from the early delivery. At the end, if you are pregnant and have any concerns or worries about Vesa Privia, be sure to talk to your doctor. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.